What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. You're gonna have to ignore the echo. Today we're doing an empty apartment tour and when apartments are empty, they echo. So it is what it is. All right, I'm gonna have to do this really, really quick because I have my family downstairs unloading our U-Haul. It is moving day, so I look like this because of that. Um, and it's gonna be a quick, crazy morning, um, but I really want to pop upstairs, quickly give you an empty apartment tour. This is my new apartment in downtown Toronto. I'm just so excited. I cannot wait to show you guys. So, you know, all of that jazz. If you want to see the whole move-in process, unpacking, organizing, blah, 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 make sure you subscribe. Make sure you give me a like. Let me know if you want to see anything else like this. Let's just, let's get into this. Okay. All right. So we're going to come in. We have a one bedroom apartment. You come in and we've got a door here. And then there's quite a bit of space here. So we're gonna have like a shoe rack over here. I'm thinking like a mirror or something like that up there. Um, this unit is wheelchair accessible. So there's a lot of room between things, which is really nice. And you're gonna turn and go this way. Here, we've got some double doors and just opens up this is our washer and dryer. We're gonna put some storage stuff here. We're gonna get one of those like long carts um, to put like laundry detergent and stuff. And on the other side here, we've got just a regular coat closet. We'll have like a shoe rack in here for Chris's shoes. Classic downtown Toronto, we got sirens. All right, here is the bathroom. Super cute, I love this really tall cupboard. Chris will be able to reach stuff up there. I'm gonna get some like bins if I can find small enough ones um, because it's kind of like awkward to reach. And I love just like the color scheme here. Got some more shelves in there. And I love these drawers. So they're drawers and they go around. This needs to be fixed, that's fun, okay. <laughs> Okay then, uh, and then we've got another one under here. I like the color of these floors quite a lot. Shower rack, it's our big shower, which is really nice. We've got a full tub, nice and tall, I love the tile. This is our view coming out of the bathroom. We've got our kitchen here. We've got this little space over here. Where I'm thinking maybe bar cart, something nice on the wall, I'm not sure. Lots of space here to walk. This wall here, I'm definitely gonna be putting up some art or something like that. We've got an island, which is quite hard to find in Toronto, actually. And a lot of times it's just like the kitchenette and you don't get an island. Really like this one. And we've got some bar stools for that. Super little fridge, but I'm gonna make it work. Got some drawers there, which I've never had before. And then everything's really cool. It's like soft clothes. And this here is the cutlery drawer, which is really interesting. Our cute little stove, our cooktop. Um, got a nice pantry space. And then we've got a disguised dishwasher, which I'm very excited about. That is the kitchen for you. And moving on, we have our living room. It's very, very small, but it's gonna be okay. Everything we got is gonna fit perfectly in here. We've got our couch going on this side with like a nice little lamp. And then we're gonna have our TV going over here. And then heading into the bedroom, also very small. They advertise that you can fit a queen size bed, but that's about it. That's all you can fit. So we're gonna have our bed here. Here we're gonna mount a TV. We have a guy coming on Monday to do that. Here I have a desk, that's where my vanity is gonna go. A really nice velvet chair, a beautiful vanity mirror. I'm really excited about this is the closet. Got my purse in there. The closet's gonna be interesting to see how we're gonna fit two people's clothes. And interesting that we have a sliding door. And last but not least, this is our balcony. I'm not gonna go out there because it is quite loud. Our view is incredible. I wish you could see, but it's just water for days and days and days. And you see it right when you walk in the apartment. Quite a big balcony. I'm, I have so many plans for that. All right, guys, I'm so excited. I'm so excited for you guys to be here with me, to see me go through this whole unpacking process. I'm so excited for the lighting. The lighting in here is impeccable in almost every single room, which is amazing. Yeah, I'm just so excited for this process. So make sure you stay tuned for the moving updates and also stay tuned to the end of the video because this is also going to turn into like a moving vlog. So I'll see you in a little bit. I gotta get my ass downstairs. Oh my god, the lighting is impeccable in here. 
All right guys, so it is a few days later. It's actually Wednesday. I think the last time I talked to you was Saturday, which was move-in day. I wanted to vlog a lot more for you, but it's just been chaotic. Um, this is a, like a pretty small space with not a lot of storage, so it's been really hard to figure out like where we're gonna put everything and what we still need to get and stuff, so it's kind of hard to like film that process, but I thought that I would just come on and show you an update of how everything's looking, and then I think I will pick up a new vlog later to show you more of like the moving unpacking process. Yeah, we'll see what happens there, um, but let me like give you a little tour of the uh, chaos that's going on here right now. All right, let's start with the bedroom. <laughs> We've got our TVs mounted, so that was good. Um, we've got a bunch of boxes that I need to go through. Gotta go through all that. We've still got our suitcases. Their current nightstand situation, so my suitcase. Um, Chris's dad, I think, is actually building us some floating nightstands, which is really, really nice. Um, this, we've got all this chaos here. Haven't even touched the closet yet, but this I'm gonna get to today. This is kind of cute. I've got my vanity here. We've got this um, cute black vanity chair. This is a DIY here. This is like a dusty rose pink color, if you remember. And Chris's mom actually um, painted it for us. And we're just doing another sanding and another coat. Um, and then it'll be finished. I have this desk. I have this cute little vanity mirror. It actually does have a light, which is really cute. And then I thought, I don't know, maybe just my dream board look cute. This bed has um, roll out drawers, which are massive. I can't even like get it all on camera. The bed is not staying like this. I'm going to be changing out all the bedding. I'm gonna get some like artwork there. Um, lots of plans for this room. I'll show you the living room. Chris is in here working, but over here, we decided to stand this um, shelving unit up. It's a Calyx from Ikea. Um, I'm gonna get four bins and kind of like stagger them throughout. Um, that's gonna be cute and there'll be a bunch of like decor and stuff on there. We're gonna get a TV stand um, to go here. Again, TV's mounted. Got some bins to go through. My coffee table, I've got a bunch of stuff to like organize. This is, we're not gonna have this stuff on here. I'm gonna be putting it like over here on like a little table or something. And this I wanna do like a coffee table book and like some decor and stuff like that. And we've got this massive <laughs> just pile of stuff. Um, a lot of this, the stuff here I still have to find home for. But this kind of stuff um, and a bunch of stuff back there is going to be going down to our storage locker. We just gotta get it out of the way still. We've got um, some stuff under here I need to take care of. This island, can't wait to clear all this off so that I can go through it all. Um, this is kind of the situation. The cupboards. I'm working on it, I'm figuring it out, I don't know. Um, I wanna get like some more risers. I think I wanna move this stuff up here with some risers and just kind of switch it all around. Working on that. Don't mind this, we literally just made lunch. In here, this is utensils. I'm gonna get something to display these on the counter. Um, and then maybe some like dividers or something to organize this eventually. This, we're waiting for our cutlery, these are plastic. Uh, we've just been washing them and reusing them. Our cutlery we're actually getting on Friday, so that'll be in here. And this drawer is just some stuff that I haven't, I don't use that often, um, but it's in here. This drawer over here, this is like my regularly used like pots and pans and stuff. Drinking glasses. And here's just like some oils and vinegars. And then here's all of our plates and stuff. Got some stuff in the dishwasher right now. And this, it's actually gonna be for our shoes, uh, but it doesn't fit our shoes because we got big feet. So this is temporary. I think this is actually going to go in the bathroom, but for right now, this is good. We wanna get a, like a bigger one, um, like wider to fit more stuff. And then I think the idea of having like a little coffee drink bar will be really, really cute once we get that all set up. This is a washing machine. We're still working on this. I think, I'm not really sure what's gonna happen in here. Originally, we were, we were gonna be putting our chairs, like these folded chairs. Um, we we're gonna be putting in there, but actually we don't need to now because now we've got a storage locker So we've got some room there. I think this will probably be like brooms mop I'm gonna figure out the vacuum situation. We're not sure where there's an outlet We're thinking maybe if we slide these over a little bit some way uh, We might be able to plug in the vacuum so TBD I don't even know where the vacuum cord is right now Closet here. It's behind the door. It will be a shoe closet um, this bathroom super cute We have a guy actually coming. I haven't been able to put anything away yet because it's a whoop, you gotta fix this, it's like super wobbly, you noticed that earlier. Um, so I haven't put anything away yet. They're also fixing um, this cabinet because it's very like shaky on the wall. And we just wanna make sure that that doesn't come down on us. We got bins, a bunch of bins and stuff. I gotta go through all this. The shoe cabinet is actually gonna go here um, and we're gonna take that rack off of the wall and put it in storage. Um, and that thing's gonna hold like towels, toilet paper, 
all that fun stuff. Maybe put up some cute like art or something up here. Hang the towel somewhere. Shower curtain. Not loving the shower curtain. Um, it feels very plain and boring to me. Um, it was just really, really cheap and the best one that I could find, the one I really wanted, was like $85 and I'm like, mm, maybe not right now. I don't really need that, so this is fine for now. And then I'm going to be getting um, like a shower caddy. I'm just waiting for a black one, which is at Target, but we can't go to the States yet, so I'm gonna wait for that till we can finally go over. So that is the current situation in the apartment. There's a lot going on, it's very chaotic, it's been very hard to film. Um, just it's a lot of thinking and a lot of yeah, it's just a lot <laughs> That's kind of where we're at for right now. I'm going to say goodbye I'm gonna start a new vlog soon. Um, so stay tuned for that and yeah Just thank you guys so much for being here following along this process This apartment is my dream right now It doesn't feel like it because I'm very overwhelmed, but it is my dream. It's definitely something I manifested and I Yeah, I'm just so grateful that you're here to like join me on this process and see where we end up eventually Maybe you want to paint a wall or something I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you back here for the next one. Bye!